Well, hello. Hello, hello. Um, it has been a while. Welcome back to my channel. Um, after a lot of harassment and comments, I am back. Back and I'm better. Um, I know it's been a really long time since I've done a video. Um, I have no idea what I'm going to do today, but you know what? Let's do the damn thing. I hope everyone's been doing well. I hope you've started your new year fantastically. I hope everyone is in just enjoying life and in a great phase. We are blossoming over here. Fucking damn it, already cursing. Anyways, <laughs> I hope everyone's been great. Um, I feel like bring super bright today, so I'm gonna get a little wild. Um, let's just jump right into it because I don't even know. So I know I'm gonna be working with these two palettes. Um, this is Party Animal by Laura Lee. Um, this thing is super cuckoo. <sighs> Kinda got a little wild in there, but it's okay. Um, really great colors, and as well as per usual, when I'm feeling crazy, I'm still on this um, NYX Ultimate Brights. Um, yeah, I don't know, life's just been busy and good, but very busy. Um, a lot of things have been changing for me in a really great way and I've just been, I just haven't had time and to, to sit here and do my makeup, I haven't really been doing my makeup too much, but I just tweezed my brows a little so they're looking pretty pop and pop pop. Um, and I did this awesome bath bomb face mask lip scrub morning so I'm feeling good, I'm feeling into it, I'm ready. Let's do it you guys, let's get cute. Cause I'm sure people are wondering if I still have a base or not, but. All right, so let's see if I can find things because that hasn't changed. I don't know where anything is. Um, let's see here. I think I wanna start with, um, I don't know, I just feel like I'm gonna just do a bunch of colors. I did this crazy colorful look um, the other day and it was pretty cool. And I kinda wanna do one. This is off of um, this girl's makeup Instagram I saw. I'll put the link in the description. Let's see if I can do it or if it looks like shit. Cause if it looks like shit, I'm not gonna tell her I tried to recreate her look. <laughs> but yeah, so, all right, let's just do it. We're gonna go in with this green over here. Some money green. We don't have any Waffle House yellow today, but we are gonna do money green to get started, okay? Oh, okay. Yeah, okay, that's a little better. I have to change that real quick. But yeah, so we're just gonna bring this green all up in here because I'm gonna um, blend it into a blue, which I don't really mess with blue, but we'll see what happens here, okay? So don't don't judge me, all right? Because we all know I never really know what I'm doing. But we're gonna look pretty at the end of this, so it's okay. We're about to go from like a three to a 10. What's good? What's poppin'? Ooh, ooh. All right. It's hump day. Feeling it. Feeling it. I feel like I should be cute because I have to close the bar tonight. So, at least you know. If y'all live in my area, come get some drinks. Okay, I'll make you some drinks. Not only do I drink them, I make them too. I know, shocking, right? <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, so um meanwhile I did this awesome lip scrub today. I'll show you guys when I'm not away from it. Um I actually have one right here. Where is it? So this is the bomb that goes on after, but it's just from Trader Joe's and it was this lip scrub. Oh my lips feel like a baby's bottom. Super soft if you don't have kids. <laughs> baby's bottoms are really soft. Assuming you don't have diaper rash. But yeah, so, all right, we're gonna, that looks pretty good. I don't wanna go too crazy with the green because I'm gonna go over it, as I said. Um, I'm not using any fancy brushes, as we all know this. We just wing it over here, okay? I'm not a pro makeup person. I just wing it, got my shit thrown everywhere. I don't, no, I'm not, no, not a fancy person. Um, let's see, I don't know if I want to, kinda just wanna blend it with this brush, so I think I'm actually just gonna continue using, this is like a very wide, fluffy, blending brush. I like it a lot because when I'm doing all these crazy colors, it, it really sets them well. Now, if I want to pack a brush on, like pack a color on, you know, then we'll, we'll get that, get that crack a lacking. Wow, I forgot how fun it is to talk to yourself on camera. <laughs> oh, 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 and I forgot, I look like such a 12 year old, whatever, but my skin is popping. So y'all can't tell me nothing. You see this coconut oil just finessing over here. 
blendy blend because blending is our friend yes i still sing that song stop judging me <laughs> anyways mm. now last time i used this blue it wasn't too much of my friend so i kind of wanna fuck it let's try it damn it i'm really trying not to curse you guys it's really hard <laughs> We're just gonna, let's see, let's see if it works. So I'm gonna go in with the Laura Lee Karaoke. I'm gonna try this blue. I don't know how they do this, this blue over here. This thing, it's, it's hard to hold your makeup and point. Things. Clearly I have no hand eye coordination. <laughs> I'm a dipshit, but it's okay. It's all good in the hood. This might turn out really fugly, so obviously I'm not gonna post it if it does. But I hope it doesn't, cause it looks super cool. So I'm just gonna bring that blue into the corner here and kind of blend it up into the green because this look is going to have like five colors. So, assuming it works out properly, I'm going to need this space, okay? This is why I don't mess with blue because I feel like it looks like I got hit and uh, not with it. Not with it, but hopefully it'll all turn out properly. See, I feel like it doesn't blend as great as I want it to, but you know what? It's looking better than last time. So let's pack that in there a little bit. Pack, pack. Pack it, pack it, yeah, pack it like a suitcase. Oh, we going on vacation. All right, and I guess we'll put the same on this side so that way, you know, it actually looks like we're doing the same thing. God, I'm so funny. <laughs> Don't, this is why living alone is fantastic, you guys, because you can talk to yourself, you know? Talking to yourself is actually a sign of intelligence, so I don't wanna hear any funny comments, okay? Stop judging me, I can feel it. All right, so that's working out pretty well, minus all this fallout that does have, a, well, might just be because my brush is so big, but there is pretty much a little bit of fallout over here. But so we're just gonna blend that blue on the lid up into the crease so it's in with the green. You see what I'm doing here? Y'all see what I'm doing here? Amazing! Ooh. And I just realized I left those in there. Poop. Oh well, we'll get those in a minute. But so we're just gonna make sure that's real nice and blended. We'll kind of not look like and beating myself up in the middle of the night. Okay, so like it. Now you can see like it's nicey blendy blend, blendy blend, blended. It's actually not even as good as that. This eye looks popping. There's always one, isn't there? Like why do y'all have to play with my feelings? It's just not nice. It's not nice. Okay, but it's okay because we have to go back in anyways and put like six more colors up in here. All right, so now we're gonna go, I'm gonna use a smaller brush since we're moving into the eye. Let's get, I'm gonna use this fine tapered brush here. Let's see if this works for me. I'm gonna go back onto this palette now, the Ultimate Brights, and I'm gonna get some purple action. Purple, purple, purple. I'm just gonna dab that mother effer in there. And we're gonna tap, tap, tap it. Ooh, look at, I can be, I used, always wanted to be in percussion, but I played the clarinet, you know? It's okay, we'll get over it. Dun, 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 dun. So then we're gonna move on to purple up in here. And I'm kind of just gonna bring that to where the end of the green is because then we're gonna go light. So we want to blend this purple out right here. Like right under to where the green is ends about a little over half my eye. Okay, we're in there. Oh, look at us. We're already looking like a little peacock. I don't think that's what peacocks sound like at all, but it fit, so whatever. All right, so we're just kind of packing. I'm just kind of dabbing. Damn, white people. <laughs> Sad moment, I don't know how to dab. All right, so we're just gonna kind of leave that there. Yes, I see it's a line. I'm gonna blend it after. I don't wanna hear it. Whoa, it's gonna be great today. Can you feel the vibes, you guys? Can you feel it? Cause I'm having a great morning over here. Having a great flipping morning. All right, so that's kind of cool. Let's see if I can mess up some more stuff. Um, again, I want to go in with another, probably use this brush, just because I can get into the crease. Um, I want to say they put like a, I don't know. This is why I don't follow pictures, because it's hard. It's hard, but you know what? I already like it. I'm feeling really peacocky, and I'm, I'm kind of with it with it um before i do do this i'm gonna take that big brush again just kind of get some of that blue off there because i want to blend that purple back into the blue you feel me so we're gonna like get a little like back action that way 
it's not so cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. Because that line is pretty harsh. Look at all my freckles. You'd think I'd go outside more. <laughs> it's like... All right, so then I'm gonna go back in with this brush that I kill all the time. Um, I kind of want, I'm gonna go with this orangey color, orangey red, don't really know. We're gonna take this up here into the crease. And it doesn't look like it's showing up, but it is. <laughs> Looking like a little leprechaun up there, huh? Always after my lucky charms. All right. Okay, so we're working. I don't really know how this is gonna look, but uh, right now it looks like a bad batch of Fruit Loops, so whatever, we'll find out. But my biggest thing that I've learned is don't judge your face until the whole face is done. Because your eyeshadow most of the time looks like shit until your whole face is on. So just keep that in mind, you guys. Because right now I would be like, yo, I'm taking this shit off. But we're not going to do that. It's a waste of product. And I'm hoping it turns out good because I don't want to redo anything. All right, so I'm just taking this orange. I want it kind of pop in, you know, pat, pat. Um, all up in here, all up in there, whatever we're gonna blend again. So let's tap that out pretty much. Um, I want some pink pink. Now I have two good pinks that I like. The only difference is the bottoms up one on the Laurel Lee, this pink at the bottom, um, is has some like sparkle in it where the NYX is not, it's just like a matte. I think I'm gonna go matte because I'm gonna add sparkle later. Surprises, can't tell you yet. So I'm gonna cake this on, starting on top of the purple so that it has its own little section. Oh God, it's going underneath, oh shit. All right, we had some fallout up in this mofo, but it's okay, okay, so we got pink, you can see it. All right, we're working. Don't be scared, don't be scared. It'll all work out okay, okay, don't be scared guys. Okay, we'll just blend that through. Looking like a Lisa Frank palette. Let's hope you're old enough to know what that is. All right, so we got some pink. Let's just figure this out real quick. I have no idea what's going on, you guys. No idea. Yeah, that's a lot of colors. <laughs> I like it, me like it. I just wanna try and finesse this line here. Yeah, okay, we're kicking, we're working, we're rocking. All right, so I actually might just go like this and kind of do this. That way it's more of a transition. There we go. Okie dokie. So screw that little corner there. Okay, so I just kind of blend that pink up into that orange that we had going on. See, we're looking pretty colorful. We already look at it. It's like it's already down here for us. How exciting is that? Um, yeah, so that's actually, that actually turned out pretty cool. Like, the lighting sucks. But, let's see if I can brighten this. Is it doing anything? Kind of ex overexposing. But, yeah, see, look. It looks pretty good. I'm surprised. Okay, I'm, I'm not, I'm not too irritated with this. Um, yas, queen, yas. All right. I do want, you know what I want? I might mess up this whole thing because that's what I do best is mess stuff up and go home. But I'm already home, so check that out. <laughs> I want some yellow because I feel like yellow is a pop pop. Um, I was even going to do this. It's a party color, but um, I don't think it's going to be what I want. So let's just see. We can just take some up here. You know, get that lash, um, lash line, full oh, brow line. God, clearly I need a nap already. Been napping a lot lately. I was like, maybe you're dying. Just kidding, just me. Overworking myself as usual. <laughs> Life is so fun, but it's okay. We gonna be rich. All right, yeah, see that kind of, that's kind of cool. I like it, brings it all together. We're gonna do the same thing over here. Just blend that yellow lightly into the edge of all the colors at the top. 
also doesn't leave that line so harsh with that dark color. Kind of smooth it into like a better green. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah we in there. All right, so let's just make this one look prettier. It doesn't look like baby poop green. If you guys have ever seen that green baby poop, it is traumatizing. Shout out to my nephew for having the grossest blowout I've ever seen the first time I ever changed his diaper. Thanks. Um, yeah, this actually turned out really freaking popping. Oh, I'm pumped, you guys. All right, I say let's not mess with it too much. Um, now there is gonna be a lower area to this look, um, but I wanna do, I think I wanna do my liner first because we all know I like to wing it. Um, as per usual, the best and only liner that I use now, <laughs> this is, I don't change. I buy the same things all the time. It is my Kat Von D Tattoo Liner in Trooper Black. Can we see that? Will that focus? Probably not. But it's okay. You guys see it. You see it? Okay, cool. Um, I love this. It's actually a brand new one. So I'm like, oh, it's going to be magical. Okay, so excited. Um, yeah, this stuff is, is my jam. I freaking love this stuff. I'm trying to go like this so that you guys can actually see me do it. I know you're not supposed to pull your eye. I pull my eye. Leave me alone. Get wild. All right. Cool. Alright, pretty poppin'. Okay, that one turned out like <laughs> poppin' on the first try. Now this one's probably gonna look like booty hole, but it's okay. <laughs> Alright, yeah, this lighting is not working with me. Let's go like this. Alright. Sorry, you can't really see, but I need- Look at how good it looks in the light! Wow! <laughs> I'm excited. I'll have to touch it up anyways. Yeah, this turned out pretty good. Like, seeing the light, the colors look popping. Pop, pop, yeah. Okay, so let's put some primer on. Um, Smashbox, I'm almost out of this. It was a tester, but it's amazing. Um, this little primer, shebang bang. Yo, rock on. Kind of looks like some suspicious fluids, but you know what? I don't know what the age group is on this, so we're not going to talk about it. All right, so I just kind of rub this all over my face mind you i already had coconut oil as per usual soaking in to my skin so I'll let that dry for a second Ooh. and then um almost out of this too i go back and forth honestly between there's a benefit one too somewhere floating around here um but like pretty much like they're all the pore fillers primers um they call this photo finish this one's really good i like this one too not the consistency this one's kind of freaky um this one's my favorite and the benefit one too is good too um but i haven't gotten that one in a while but yeah see this one comes out like a, a clear matte gel and i feel like that's how it makes your makeup look so i always put it into my under eye area here because i want that to look smoothy smooth then i rub it out same on this side same little for your five head if you got one because this thing is big, it needs some love. Full of knowledge up in here. All right, we're in there. Feeling good, feeling good. I'm glad I tweezed today, you guys, because my brows were looking like two bushes that I found outside. All right, so we're in here. And typical, um, I still haven't gotten on the foundation train. I almost tried it since Tarte came out with one, um, but I don't feel like I need that much coverage. If you do use foundation, this is when you would apply said foundation. I do have, um, some stuff that I got as a present from my friend but it's not my shade and I wouldn't want to mess up my whole face by doing that so you know I'm just gonna like do the use just like under here and then we go under here whatever I do here here ooh, 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 ooh. cool 
I feel like that's plenty for my face. I don't, I don't like to put that much crap on there. Um, let's damp my beauty blender. This is my designated water bottle for my beauty blenders because this is where I sit and do my makeup. That's why you guys are in my room today. So I don't really bring my crap out into the living room. So you damp your beauty blender, it's dampened. Now we blend, hence beauty blender because we're gonna blend the beauty. That's us. <laughs> turned out better than I thought. It looks pretty. I'm excited. So just blend, blend, blend. Dab, 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 dab. Dab, 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 dab. Get to a little. My nostrils are a pain in the butt. They like are like real defined. So I always try and you know. Um, the reason I put concealer above my upper lip, some people always ask me that, is because when I do my makeup, I want my lip line to be covered like this. Because when I pick my lipstick, you feel me? I've been on a gloss kick lately though. That Fenty Beauty gloss is my fave. I've been doing that. Which I don't know. And I feel like this deserves a, a lippy. Maybe a brown so it's not so much. So we're dabbing. We're dabbing. We're dabbing. Dab, dab, dab. I feel like there's so much color on top. I don't want to get too wild on the bottom, so I might not do that at all. Now, fun fact, you guys, as an improviser and as someone who doesn't buy the proper beauty supplies half the time, um, I ran out of my favorite bronzer, and I can't find it. So, like, I can't find it in the store. So, what I've been doing, I found my Naked One palette, and Buck, which is this light brown right here, yeah, right here, um, it works pretty well as a little contouring color, so... I take my brush that I like to use there and I just, you know, ever so gently. Don't go crazy because it is a brown. You're going to look like you got hit by it with a 2x4. And the reason I always say that, someone asked me, like, how would you know what it looked like you hit by a 2x4? Tommy Boy. You guys never seen Tommy Boy? Really? Holy shnikes. But yeah, so, you know. Get it popping. See, even that's a little dark, but like you see, we're going to blend it, so it's okay. Just a little light graze over the face. Don't push too hard or it's not gonna look good. And then it ends up looking like a dirt spot. That happens to me often. Um, you know, probably do the same on the other side. That's normally a good idea. See how dark it comes out when you barely touch it? So, and then it's like when this side, it came out darker than this side. So I'm gonna use some of this to go around the sides of my face where I'm gonna put bronzer anyways, because I don't want to use all that in one spot see and now we blend it out see how that see how easy that was don't be scared don't be scared and then always get your double chin because you know i'm trying to look cute not like i don't want to look like how i did before i want to look better thank you all right so this is pretty good this is pretty good um if you like to bake you can bake right there i cheat because i have things to do today so i'm just gonna whoo, clean that up a little bit with my beauty blender that way it's like a nice little cut cheekbone how you doing shoddy um so yeah so that i just used for this little detail um i'm still stuck with my stila um i guess what do they call this they call this a bronzer it's like very rose goldy i like to use it because it looks a little more oh that was dark <laughs> um but yeah, you can, we can blend that out. Um, it just gives a little bit of like tint to your face where it looks like you may have a tan. Clearly I don't go outside so that doesn't work for me, but it makes people think I do. Um, blend that out, blend that out. Oh, that wasn't that bad, thank God. And then with the blush, it'll look good too. So we'll get that, we're in there. And then I have to pick what lashes, oh, crazy. All right, this headband is just like moving back. <laughs> Okay, you see them baby hairs though. Ashanti sideburns on for leak. Let's get this five head looking like a forehead. Okay. Um, blush. 
I never know which one I want. I have a couple of the same ones. These are my go-tos. Um, they're both tart. Um, this one's my favorite. It's called Magic. This one's fantastic. I actually might do a little bit of both since it's pinky pink with all these colors. So I use a Kabuki brush. This is just an elf one. It's like $2 at Walmart or CVS, whatever. Get a little smile on them. I don't like too much of the pink one because sometimes you look like a Barbie doll. And yeah, sometimes I look cute, but I'm not a Barbie at all. Um, so then I'm going to go back in with this one. <laughs> fake smile, fake smile, fake smile, okay. Apples with the cheeks, apples. And then I just kind of bring it all together that way you have at least some sort of the same colors everywhere. So see, <laughs> we're cute. Okay. Um, I want to brush these brows back up because my eyebrows are really hairy. And I did just trim them. Um, for my brows, I always use the um, Brow Precise Maybelline. It's got a brush on one end pencil on the other I dig it I mean, it's, it's pretty cheap I like it and my brows turn out good so skirt um wow this turned out pretty good you guys so let's prep ourselves for some lashes my favorite time with the flash the highlighter look at it's getting to the bottom you guys I've had it for so long but I'm not getting rid of it because it's still perfectly good okay so we're gonna ooh, ooh, ooh. I've kind of like given up on my fan brush because I can't get enough glitter on it at one time and I have to reapply. And so yeah, I like to go super cuckoo with my highlight. Mm -hmm. So I use this brush to get the side over here so we can catch all these light angles. You get, oh, glowing already like a freaking disco ball. Would you look at that? Okay, get the bridge of your nose. The way we look like we're all in a photo shoot over here. Ooh, ball of your nose, because, you know, who doesn't like shiny balls? <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that. Okay. Ooh, oh, Zam! Where did you come from? Look like Xenon, girl of the century over here. Supernova girl. Oh, remembers that movie when I was lit. All right. Looking nice. A little hoo hoo just to make it shiny. Oh, you get your cupid's bow because that hella accentuates your lipstick. Yep, all up in there. Ooh, nice and shiny. And then right down here, magical. All right, so then we've got the typical great lash Maybelline. Um, I always go over my lashes with mascara before I put falsies on because it helps them stick and I'll probably fix that eyeliner because it's kind of bugging me I always do my mascara on the bottom lashes because we love our bottom lashes just adds a whole little, it's like, you know, little pat. Okay. Bottom lashes are good. Top lashes are good. Oh, this is looking so good. This turned out so good. Um, before I do put my lashes on, though, I'm going to do final touches of highlighter, which is always brow bone. See how much that just like, ooh. Just like brings the whole dang look together. And then I always go corner of the eye. Drag it into the color even. Just think it brings everything together. Oh man, I don't know what lipstick to do, you guys. This is so, this turned out so good. Um, I wanna do some glitter too. I'm gonna do that before my lashes. Um, I don't know if I wanna go. I don't know, we'll figure that out after, we'll figure it out. Okay, so I went and did some crazy things off camera because I didn't know how it was gonna turn out. I added glitter all the way through the crease to the corner. And I put my lashes on, which were regular um, Ardell 
Mega Volume Lashes, I believe number 251. Those are my favorites, those are my go-tos. And they're cheap, so I dig them. Um, lipstick, I'm gonna do brown since there's so much colors going on. Um, this is a Kat Von D Liquid Matte um, Lipstick. I believe the color is Bow and Arrow. It's kind of scratched, I can't really see it. But I've been living in this. It's got like a nice um, red undertone to the brown, but it's really, really smooth. It looks good. Alright guys, so we're all done. Um, I put my lipstick on. Uh, I'm gonna fix this fro. But our final look, you can see better on this side. Turned out really freaking awesome. I'm really happy with it. It looks awesome. Totally cool. I'm loving it. Um, now I should just get out of my pajamas and continue with my day. <laughs> Um, but thank you guys for watching. I know it's been a long four months without a video. I appreciate everyone who's commented and has noticed that I stopped doing videos. Um, you guys are really awesome. I didn't believe that people actually watch my videos. Um, but thank you so much. Um, I'm going to try and continue doing them more often. And thanks again for watching. I hope everyone has a great day and uh, feel some good vibes. Thanks.